All right, so you're probably wondering what's under the bag. This is um, a bargain I got at Dex. It's a Field and Stream shooter's bench. It's a collapsible and portable shooter's bench. Uh, about a month ago, I was at Dex Sporting Goods, and um, I saw it for about $170. And I was thinking about buying it, and I said to myself, do I really need this? And I, I didn't buy it. Yesterday, I was at the same store, and I noticed this bag. It wasn't in a box. It was in a bag. And um, I asked the salesperson, is this the collapsible shooting bench? And he said, yes, it is. And I picked it up for $39. I got it. And then I said to myself, at that price, yeah, I need it. So uh, let me show you what it looks like. I'll get you the dimensions and everything. I just put it under the bag right now because it's I didn't want to put it in. Then with one hand to remove it. Flat. It's about five feet long, and oh, there's my little buddy he wants to fight with the ruler. And high, the height is about nine inches when it's collapsed. Come on, Jackson, do it, you? So, let me show you how this works. It comes with the shooting rest. It comes with a bag to put some of your gear in. And it's easy, it lifts. Okay, now, it has two settings. You can put it, you can, you can put the table leaning back or a little bit more forward. Let me see if I can see this in the camera. Just bear with me. Here you go. All right, and the seat, comes up to it. Now the seat is adjustable. It has it has two uh, screws here that you can slide it back or forward. Okay. I keep it in the middle. Here is your your shooter's rest. Let me raise the camera a little. And the shooter's rest right here. There's, there's a way of tightening it, tightening it here. You can shoot, I guess, put it on the left or you can put it on the, on the right hand side, whatever your preference is, and it, 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 uh, it grabs into place. It has an adjustable height. You can go this high if you want. You can put it on close to the bottom, but once you cinch it tight, it ain't going nowhere. Now, The accessory pouch is, okay, it's got a molly attachment too. You can put more pouches on it if you want. You can also put a knife on here if you want, or whatever you, you prefer. Your mag holders. And you can either put it on this side, or you can put it on the other side of the bench. I'll give you a close up of the bench. The table height on this, the table height, Approximately 38 inches. The seat height is approximately two feet. And the seat's padded, the table's padded. Like I said, I picked this up for $39. I'll show you a close up of it. I picked it up for $39, and you can't go wrong at that price. There's my little buddy. He's got to see me film. Hey, Jax, say hello. Are you not amused now? No, you can All right, so. The seat locks up here. This is the pin to release the seat. You pull it and it'll, and it'll slide forward. There is no adjustment other than one setting for the seat. And I don't know if you can see it. Under here, there's some bolts that you tighten and you can slide the seat back and forth. It looks like it's made out of nylon and some pleather over here. So it seems durable enough. The cat's been crawling on it. It has two pouches that come out. I guess you could put spent shells in one and shells in the other, or you could put spent shells on both if you reload, save your shells. It has padding where you're leaning up against on the table. It comes off. Here's the padding here. The whole thing comes off if you want to. You know. 
take it off. There's your holder. Um, I'm probably just gonna not use this. I'm gonna probably put sandbags in the front and sandbags in the back. And here's the uh, two pouches that it came with, and it's got webbing on it. So if you want to put, I guess you could put magazine holders on here if you're shooting an AR, or you know, you can fasten whatever you want and set this up the way you want it. And like I said, it's it's um, the latches. They're hard to put on once once you put them on. They stay, and there's also you can latch it onto this side if you want. You know, I don't see anything wrong with the table. You know, thirty-nine dollars to save me the effort of putting it together. I also had a receipt, uh, a coupon because I filled out the survey on uh, Dick's website, and they give you ten percent off. So I had another ten percent off on my ammo purchase in this, and I saved thirty-five dollars. So I really walked out paying five dollars for this table, and um. You know, I'm going to take it upstate to the hunting camp. Uh, instead of leaning on a chair and a homemade table, now I have a shooter's bench. And um, here's the adjustment for the uh, bench. Sorry about this. It's hard doing this with one hand. But you pull here, and this will, um, let, me, let me get it first. Once you pull there, you have another attachment here, another setting. And then it... There's a third setting here if you really want to make the table a little bit lower, but you, you practically, you, you practically, you know, I don't see an adult being able to use this. Maybe it's a child, you know, but you got to lean the seat back. You got to slide this all the way back. But it, it is adjustable. I like that it folds and I could put it in the bed of my pickup truck and store it in the house. And then when I want to do shooting on my property, I could just take it out. It... It has four rubber feet, so if you're out in the field, make sure your field, wherever you mount this, it's going to be level because it looks like you only got about, I'd say, an well, inch and a half of clearance here. So it, whatever you put that on has to be has to be nice and level. And um, there you have it. You know, like I said, 170 bucks. I start questioning if I need it. But uh, for $39 and then $5 after my $35 uh, discount, I can't complain. So, let me uh, stow it away. Let me show you how easy it stows away. Let me latch down the camera here for a second. Okay, so let me show you how this falls, comes together. There's two knots. All I like to do is loosen up those knobs so I can adjust the seat all the way back. Okay, so let me put the seat back up right now. Now, stow it away, you just lower the seat, pull this, bring it down, but first take this off. how it stores away. Let me show you the bag. Jax likes the bag. He likes to sit in it. Well, you have the big storage pouch there. That's where you can put the rest. You have two more storage pouches here if you want to put ammo in there. And um, like I said, Jax likes the bag. It's made by Field and Stream. I saw this priced early in the year for, I believe it was about $170. It's called, uh, the name on it is Adjustable Shooting Bench. I saw it for about $170. And when the cashier went to ring it up, it came up at a price of $159. And then they called the back and they said, sure enough, yeah, it's clearance. And they gave it to me for $39. So, uh, hope you like me sharing and uh if you like the videos please like them if you like jacks like the videos yeah. oh thanks for uh watching